Oh, I bet it's the it's the front wind it's the windshield. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Where's my gat? Now horse that out here outside my door and they gonna make any noise. I tell you what, they ain't gonna regret coming out here to old Cletus's castle on the nest. I tell you, we're gonna find out just what the heck is going on. What, what, what in tarnation is going on? Charles. Cletus. What, what, what kind of ruckus you make around these parts here? I mean, it's night time. I'm trying to sleep. I'm trying to get my beauty rest. This is the way I look. Just don't happen overnight. I stole the church bus. Get in. Charles, it isn't stealing against, against what the Lord teaches us. Well, see, uh, old Jimbo, the bus driver, he done went to sleep. And I was led by the spirit to take those keys. Well, well, I guess if you was led by the spirit, I guess you can't can't argue with the Lord now. I just felt called to take this bus for a spin. Hang on, can't get up the ladder. Hang on, the Lord don't want to let me up the ladder. Now sometimes there's trials put forth before you. Here, give me a hand. You know what? How about I do it like this? I'm gonna just. There we go. There we go. I guess so. The express wrap. You are looking mighty fine with that there headdress. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now we're going go on dang old bus ride. I tell you, wow, dude, cheese <laughs> wagon. I tell you, hold on tight. My denture's gonna fall right on out of here. <laughs> gonna rattle them free brain cells loose. I tell you, I ain't seen this much gyrating since I went to Sodom and Gomorrah's. What's that? One of them lady bars? Now I prefer the term gentleman's club. <laughs> That's right. There ain't nobody but gentlemen in those sort of establishments. I tell you what, from what I've heard, I myself particularly have never been to one. The preacher might have some words about it. I'd be lying if I said I didn't see the preacher there from time to time. <laughs> Since, since I was born and raised Southern Baptist, I think it's time for a good old Southern Baptist too. When you go fishing with one of your Southern Baptist buddies, how you keep him from drinking all your beer? Oh, I don't know how. Bring two Southern Baptist buddies. Oh, to keep, oh, I see. Because they don't Cause drink. They, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't drink around each other. <laughs> That's right. Or get around on Sunday meeting. All right, we're almost at some open ground. I'm going to put this thing in third gear, see what it do. Hey, look at him go. I really, uh, I really like the taillights and the headlights. That's the best thing. <coughs> this thing is an off-road vehicle. <laughs> it's got four-wheel drive. It's almost like he walks on his tippy toes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Like he's got to go tank a tankle. Oh, goodness. I ain't even driving no more. Jesus has got the wheel. Let <laughs> <laughs> get down here. <laughs> Before I fall out the bus. All right, cheese wagon. Now you gotta be careful not to throw me off if I'm gonna be up riding here. If you attack something like this, am I gonna get yeeted into into like <laughs> tomorrow? Look, I got my gap piece on me. I get. I guess it depends on how uh, strong them toes are. I can take my shoes off and get a better grip. All right, cheese wagon. Let's get to getting. Some micro wrappers down there. That's uh, the devil trying to bring us down, sending those micro wrappers after us. If we put chairs up here. There we go. Now we're talking. All right. <laughs> there we go. Should have brought my dang fishing pole, man. Why does this feel so luxurious right now? Onward, Jeeves. Oh, cheese wagon's on aggressive now. He's going on the right page. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> what is the dude? Can you think of a practical use case to be doing this? Yeah, it's super fun. Dear Lord, we take in our hand the sword of the spirit so that we may smite down all the fiery enemies of the of the devil. Are you saying these dinosaurs are from the devil? Them raptors dang sure are, I tell you. Aren't there some people that believe dinosaurs like never existed and that's a, a lie that was told by the devil? Is it that a thing? Dude, I was talking with somebody at work the other day who shall go unnamed that does not believe dinosaurs existed. Well, I, well what? Oh. I okay. did not. I did not argue with them. Yeah, that's one of those things you just leave alone. I think. Mm -hmm. Got to pick your battle, battles, and that is not one of them. What is that thing? Is that a one of the thylacoias? Now, what's he doing? Not in his tree? Is he building his house on solid ground, or do you think he's building his house on the sand? Ain't gonna last long. Is he? Uh, Casting his seeds on uh, on the thorny ground. On the thorny ground. That's. <laughs> I thought I was taking you for a ride on the bus. <laughs> Come find out, the bus is taking <laughs> us for a ride. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel. That's right. 
Give me one more chance. Dude, I wish I had my voice back so bad. <laughs> Most aggressive Paris Harris there is. I think this is my preferred method of travel from here on out. Oh, I bet it's the, it's the front wind. It's the windshield. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where's my gat? I had an ejection seat. I got it. Now, what we gonna tell Jimbo about about these winders? We gonna tell him he shouldn't have been drinking so much. <laughs> this is so funny. I went out and tamed two paraceratheriums just so I could breed them. Just so I could do this. We're gonna see what bounty the Lord has brought us today. What what kind of manna from heaven is in this here loot crate? Oh man, with you with your flappy wings. What'd you get? A journeyman frog saddle and ascendant megotheros. Well, I guess we better drop the bus back off to Jimbo. Yes, sir. All right, guys, we're going to see you in just a bit when we make it back to church. You better be quiet now, man. Make sure to cut the engine off before you pull up. All right, we're going to have to be quiet now because Jimbo's on the inside. Get cut that engine off now. Is that about where Jimbo left? <laughs> That's about right where Jimbo left him now. We got our church bus back to church. I reckon we best go get ready for Sunday meeting then. They changed my britches. Alright guys, survive, don't die. And if you do, go recover your shit on the church bus. We'll see you next time. <laughs>